As we prepare for President's Day tomorrow, students across the country are preparing to call on President Biden to act on climate change, including students from right here in the Treasure Valley. Our Jude Binkley joins us. He spoke with one of those students tonight organizing the climate crisis call to action. Jude, what is their goal with this? Well, Carolyn, these students say the climate crisis is at our doorstep and they're calling on the president to declare a climate emergency. From fires to flooding, changes to the nation's climate can have a noticeable impact on Idahoans, including the GEM state's future generations. I think it's really important that young people feel like they can take action and use their voices. Maggie Scanlon is a student at Bishop Kelly. While the minds of many students her age focus on grades and their weekend plans with friends, Scanlon is thinking outside her own world about how the world can address climate change. She first learned about climate activism from a Greta Thunberg TED Talk. Inspired, Scanlon and her friends started talking with legislators at the Capitol. That was my first introduction, but it's really been important to me my whole life. I am someone who does activities outdoors all day long. I do mountain biking and skiing competitively along with tennis. And so I've really felt the impacts of the fires, especially in the summer, and how that's impacted sports and like my friend's health and how people have had to adjust how they are able to go and work out and enjoy Idaho as we live in it. Scanlon is part of Bishop Kelly's Sunrise Movement, a national group mostly made up of high school and college students. They're working for climate justice and to fight the climate um, emergency that's currently happening. And we work to fight for a Green New Deal. The main focus and point we're working towards, especially tomorrow for President's Day, is to urge Biden to declare climate emergency in order to end the era of fossil fuels and create millions of green union jobs as well as preparing for climate disasters. To call on the president to declare a climate emergency, students across the country are planning to rally on President's Day. A bunch of young students coming together to show the importance of taking action. Data from the National Weather Service shows that throughout 84 years of recorded history, the 10 warmest years in Boise have all been since 2003. Scanlon says their nationwide day of action is about making sure their movement is shared across generations. Especially with the um, upcoming election, it's important that young voices that aren't necessarily going to be able to vote or like it's their first time voting can really understand the importance of using their voice and making sure that their future is going to be safe and protected and preserved for many generations to come. In the past, Biden has allocated money and investments from the Inflation Reduction Act and bipartisan infrastructure law to make communities more climate resistant. But again, Carolyn, these students are calling for him to essentially go a step further by declaring that climate emergency. I think everyone would agree they at least like to see the younger generation get involved. Thank you, Jude. Idaho